Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. To modify the color settings within a custom preset of PDF settings, click the color category that appears underneath the expanded view of the preset settings within the Adobe PDF Settings dialog box. The settings within the color category determine the color profile and color management settings to use to produce PDF documents when printing using this preset. In the Adobe Color Settings section, you use the Settings File drop-down to select a color settings profile to use for PDF conversion that is available on your computer. The profiles listed in the drop-down menu include color profiles from external graphics applications like Adobe Photoshop as well. Choosing the None setting from the drop-down allows you to manually specify the color management policies and working spaces settings in the areas that follow within this category. In the Color Management Policies section, you can use the drop-down to select the method Acrobat uses to convert unmanaged color in a PostScript file when there is no color setting selected. The choices are Leave Color Unchanged, Tag Everything for Color Management, Tag Only Images for Color Management, Convert All Colors to sRGB, and Convert All Colors to CMYK. If Leave Color Unchanged is selected, Acrobat leaves Device Dependent Colors Unchanged and preserves Device Independent Colors as the nearest possible equivalent. If Tag Everything for Color Management is selected, Acrobat tags color objects with an ICC profile and calibrates colors to make them device independent. If Tag Only Images for Color Management is selected, then Only Images are tagged with an ICC profile to prevent black text from undergoing any color shift when producing the PDF. If Convert All Colors to sRGB is selected, Acrobat calibrates the colors to make them device independent and converts all CMYK and RGB colors to sRGB within the PDF. If Convert All Colors to CMYK is selected, then Acrobat converts color spaces to Device Gray or Device CMYK according to the specifications made within the Working Spaces section. All working spaces must have an ICC profile be specified. You can use the Document Rendering Intent drop-down to specify a method used to map colors between color spaces. The end result of any method depends on the profiles of the color spaces. The intents are perceptual, saturation, relative colorimetric, and absolute colorimetric, and preserve. The preserve choice indicates that the intent is specified in the output device versus within the PDF file. Note that in all cases, however, color intent may be overridden or ignored by color management operations that occur subsequent to the creation of the PDF. In the Working Spaces section, use the Gray, RGB, and CMYK drop-down to select an ICC profile to use to define and calibrate Gray, RGB, and CMYK color images within the PDF for all color management policies other than leave color unchanged. Note that you can select the none choice for either of the three drop-downs to not convert that type of image. If the preserve CMYK values for calibrated CMYK color spaces checkbox is checked, device independent CMYK values are treated as device dependent or device CMYK values, device independent color spaces are removed, and PDF X1A files use the convert all colors to CMYK value. If it's unchecked, device independent color spaces convert to CMYK if the convert all colors to CMYK value is selected within the color management policy section above. In the device dependent data section, you can check the Preserve Under Color Removal and Black Generation checkbox to preserve both of those features if they exist within the PDF document. 
use the when transfer functions are found drop down to choose how to handle transfer functions if found within the PDF. Remove will delete the transfer functions, preserve will retain the transfer functions, and apply will apply the transfer functions but not keep them, thus changing the colors in the file. You can check the preserve halftone information checkbox to retain any halftone information found in the PDF file. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.